Hey guys, and welcome to a brand new adventure. So, this is a game that just came out. It is called Eagle Island, and it's a little bit different uh, than some of the games that I've played on the channel here. Uh, it's, well, it's different and similar. It's actually a game about falconry and eagles, and I am super excited for it because it seems like an awesome game. I've tried not to play too much ahead of this, just enough to test it out, make sure everything's working, get things set up. So, uh, I'm definitely gonna be learning as we go along, and uh, I will say, there's a bit of a learning curve, and uh, I, I'm definitely going to have a few, um, <laughs> uh, maybe maybe a few mishaps along the way, so please be patient with me. It's a little bit different than the games I usually play, and it's going to take me a bit to get used to that. But we're going to go ahead and jump in. We'll, we'll get started on the story here, and then I'll talk a little bit more about this. Uh, we're just going to be going to the normal core rules. There's hardcore or casual, but we'll just play the normal mode for now, and we will go ahead and play the game. So, I guess, uh, I think it's seed-based, it looks like, from that, too, but we'll, we'll just play the, the default here. So, under the sapphire blue sky, Quill sets off an adventure with his faithful... Can, can I go down? <laughs> How do I do this? I'm also on a controller for the first time in a long time, so pardon that as well. Uh, with his faithful owls, Koji and Ichiro. So, let's continue on. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I'm getting used to the controller controls again. Together, the three companions sail among the peaceful islands of the Otriatic Sea. Uh-oh, it looks stormy. When all at once a sharp wind sweeps from the north, and blinding lightning bolts sunder the sky. Oh man, this is getting intense. Blistering heat engulfs the boat as it bursts into flames. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, a monstrous grip tightens around Quill's chest. Oh man. Oh, and we're here, so we gotta get up. Um, so I think it's pretty standard movement controls, okay. So basically just normal controller ones. And there's kind of a neat little tutorial here. I like the way the game did this because it kind of just gives you a chance to learn. What is that? Oh, it's like a little hermit crab thing, kind of. Look, look, there's a crab there! But he runs away when you get close to him. <laughs> and of course we have our, we have our eagles here. There is a fish. There's a fish down here. Whoa! And you can kind of swim around a little bit. Uh, but there's a fish in there. You can climb. You can climb if you hit- oops. <laughs> and now I can't actually properly do it. If you hit the edge there, a lot of the time you can actually climb up, but I can't seem to actually do it, so I'm sure you'll see me do it later. But we'll continue on here. Uh, you can jump higher if you high jump like that. And so let's go ahead. If you do that, we can actually get up here. So you can see we kind of grabbed under the edge there and climbed up. We can head up here. And I think the other area is actually blocked off. Yeah, you can see there's a door down there. We'll, we'll, we'll access that later. So we're going to go up this way. And what do we have to do with these? I think there must be something we can do with these, but I don't know what it would be. It looks like there's like little power cables running along the ground. So I'm sure we'll figure that out eventually too. Oh, there's like an underground area. It goes further underground. Are we supposed to be here? What is this? I didn't actually see this when I was playing around. Oh, we got a little mini-map, too. Um, I don't know what's down here. Uh, somehow I get the feeling we're gonna find out later, though. It looks like those cables connect there, too, so I bet that's gonna be important. Uh, but I don't know what we can do with that right now, so we'll, we'll figure that out later. We'll come back, and, um, we'll go ahead. First of all, just try to jump up here, jump up here, and head out this way into the open. There's, like, a little... Oh, this, if we click on that... Oh, fast travel! Okay, so you can fast travel around, but this looks like the only one we've unlocked. So I guess we'll have different fast travel points when we get there. That's cool to know. Oh boy! Uh, that didn't look good. <laughs> that did not look good. There's also something down there that looks kind of, uh, kind of nasty. I'm not sure I want to mess with that, so... Let's continue on. Oh my gosh, there's, um... There's something coming! And I think, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, that'll hurt you. <laughs> so don't hit your head on the plant up there. I th or plant or I think it's a plant of some kind. Oh, we can't get down there. So if we go up here. We got to be careful of that. Very careful of that. I don't want to. Um, oh, I don't want to uh, <laughs> to die before we've even begun. Okay, there we go. We were able to pull ourselves up. So yeah, if you hit the edge like that, you can kind of uh, pull yourself up a little bit. The music has stopped. <gasps> oh my gosh. Um. Oh my gosh. That eagle just took our owl. Um, I'm gonna guess that's why they call it Eagle Island, because holy smokes. Um, 
Yeah, let's go after that thing, although I'm very afraid of it. <laughs> I don't know how he's- I don't think that would be an easy fight. Um, and it looks like it's long gone, but there's a person here, so let's go ahead and talk to this dude. Oop. Dr. Oliver Ornis. Hey kid, that wretched eagle seized your bird as well? Oh, I guess it has a habit of that. <laughs> I'm Dr. Oliver Ornis. Just recently, the eagle snatched feathers, my own owl. Oh no! The eagle's name is Armora. She threatens many birds on this island. Three totem birds of elemental power are hiding nearby. They hold power beyond anything you can imagine. We need to find the totems before Armura does. She only seeks to increase her own power. So is that why she must be stealing the other birds? I don't I don't know. How how does that work? I don't I'm not entirely sure, but I bet we'll find out. <laughs> Take this ancient falconry glove. Its powers will help you on your journey. Oh man, so we got a falconry glove. And this, I think, is where it all begins, friends. So, a falconer glove from ancient times. Press X to cast Koji off. So, if we do that, you can... Oh, oh, it's gonna go back to dialogue first, though. Head west now to the glade. I've seen Totem Zafara darting through the trees there. Let's hope you find her before Amura does. So, we have to we have to get to these totem birds before this uh, giant eagle does. That, that that's going to be that's going to be fine. Oh, it looks like we have saved. So, if we do this, you can see we can throw like that. So, west, I think is probably going to be this way. So, we got to go back the way we came. What's down here? Are we going to fall somewhere we can't get out of? Oh, bad things down here bad things down here. So we can destroy enemies like this. So this is kind of like the training ground, I, I guess. So we look here. To aim, a falconer should first hold X to call their bird, then point in the direction they wish to attack. Continue to point in the direction and release X to cast the bird off. So this is the part that I'm not entirely used to. I don't want to fall down there. So if we do this, we can actually point and uh, the, we can ha send off uh, our owl there to attack. So, oh boy. <laughs> so there's lots of signs. This is like a little tutorial here. So a falconer can call their bird in midair. They will remain suspended in the air until the bird is cast off. So if we actually jump and then hit X, we can kind of fly like that. And we'll uh, cast off our bird there. If we go up here, as long as their bird is successfully hitting monsters, the falconer can remain suspended indefinitely. Don't be afraid to suspend yourself above monsters. See, this is the part that I'm really bad at. And you can see these little statues kind of show you what you can do. So, this is the part I'm not too great at. This is where I tend to fall and die. So if I do this, go down, and... Oh, no! Darn it. Yep. I'm not, I'm not fantastic at these controls yet. <laughs> So, yeah, it's a little bit, it's a very, well, I'm not gonna lie, it's very, di oops, oh, I'm so sorry, I do that a lot too. I'm not gonna lie, it's very different than the games that I've played before, controls-wise, and so I definitely am learning this system for the first time. Um, that was fantastic. <laughs> uh, I, I might die a lot, you guys, um, but I'm sure I'll adapt in time. It's just a totally new control scheme, and it seems like an amazing game, so hopefully I'll be able to learn it, get the hang of it, and continue on. But yeah, um, if anybody's new to the channel, I'm not like a- oh, there we go! Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> nice. And we got a combo, it looks like, too. Oh! Oh, that's what that door is. Okay. And so this just kind of released us back into the open out here. I love the little dandelions that poof away too. And I don't think, I don't think the bird can really get hurt. We're the one who can actually get hurt. So we don't really have to worry. I mean, obviously we're kind of, kind of throwing, kind of throwing Koji at the monster. So I think he can handle himself pretty well, it seems like. So, but yeah, so if you're new to the channel, I'm not like a super great, is that a door? Oh, it is. I'm not like a super great gamer, but I enjoy, I play for fun more than, oh, what is this? The, oh, this is a fast travel point, entrance waypoint. Did I go into like a dungeon or something? If you throw, oh, times four gives you a heart. So I think that's saying if you combo, maybe, or for every, for every four enemies you kill, you get a heart maybe? Okay, we got one. Oh, we got coins, coins, give me the coins. <laughs> um. But I'm not like some sort of expert gamer or anything. I'm a, I, I game for fun, not because I'm really great at it. So, um, it's it's gonna be you know there's gonna be a learning curve. Don't 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 want if you, if you're expecting me to gr be gr just great at this game, then you're gonna be disappointed. If you're expecting me to have a fun time with this game, that that that's more what I do. Oh no, oh Koji, I'm so sorry. I feel bad whenever I just like end up smacking him into the ground like that. But he, he seems pretty durable. I, I think he must be all right. <laughs> he can kind of, he can take a hit or two it looks like. So but I still feel bad. Oh no, oh, okay. So we gotta jump closer to that. I, oh, that's not gonna, oh, 
I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness, okay, there we go. There we got him. Oh, so we can actually jump up there now, probably. And yeah, there we go. So I'm a little worried. It looks like, I'm guessing those arrows are telling us there's enemies below. So let's be kind of careful. Oh, yep. All right, let's try that. Oh no, oh no, oh no! <laughs> oh no, oh I didn't actually die though. Okay, I didn't actually die. So we're on like our last heart, I think. I think once it breaks like that, that's kind of like your final chance. Oh my goodness, I keep missing. It's kind of like a f one last chance, I think, is what that is. Okay, can I just throw from here? Yes, yes I can. <laughs> that That's an easier way of doing it, okay. So, I'll get the hang of the air tricks eventually. Yeah, you'll see. Oh, oh my goodness, they're moving. Uh, I didn't expect that. Okay, go, there we go, we got one. And we got another. And we can get another, and we can get another, I think? Oh, not not quite. So I think if you're up in the air is when you can get combos, maybe. Because I think I think that must be it. I, I've seen in the in the, the videos I've seen of this, I've seen a lot of like jumping tricks and stuff. And so that's what's gonna be a little difficult to get a hang of. Alright, let's try. There we go. Oh no! No, 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 I don't wanna die. Okay, I'm it's yeah, it's telling me I'm low on health. It is telling me I'm low on health for sure. That, that's what that beeping noise means. It doesn't it doesn't mean anything good, that's for sure. Okay, oh, and you can release X to calm back faster. There we go. Yep, it's it's telling me that it's saying, hey, hey buddy, you're you're about to die if you're not careful. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! No 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 no! That's not what I want to do. Okay, um, if I do that. Oh, just barely. Okay, hold on. You know what? We're gonna do this a slightly easier way. Oh, and apparently still not. Oh, he's trying to get me too. There we go. Okay, we got that. Oh, there's like a treasure chest down here. All right, I don't know if this, was this where I was supposed to go? Hope, hopefully it is, but it, it's a fun little tutorial area anyway. So what is this? This is a treasure chest. If I open this up, oh my goodness, so many coins. So I don't know if you like lose coins when you die. I haven't been looking too much, but okay, where does this go? There's like a raven on that, um, on that treasure chest. Is that something I'm gonna need to fight? Is he gonna come after me? Oh! If you give him silver... Is this gonna kill me? I'm scared to jump down here. No. Okay, it's not. Alright, so... We've only gonna have, like, one chance at this. Oh, no! No! <laughs> okay! Alright, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I thought we were not gonna be able to deal with that guy if we didn't, um... Oh, no! Of course! <laughs> of course we missed! Alright. Now let's try this. There we go, finally. So if we do this, then he'll let us have it. Oh, yes! Okay, dr oh, we got a magnet! Draw items toward Quill from a distance. Oh, okay, we can put that in the slot there. Sweet, so we have like power-ups and stuff too, it looks like. So this guy, oh, that's not what I wanna do. Oh, oh I'm so sorry, Koji. <laughs> this poor owl, man. <laughs> this is, <laughs> this is not going too well. <laughs> um, all right, so. If I do that, oh, don't run into the red stuff, that's poison. There we go. And, oh, missed that. Come on, there we go. And, there we go. All right, and please, please kill him before I fall on top of him, there we go. So we're like, we're heading downward. Oh, what's this guy? So you can pay money to unlock chests, it looks like. So I wonder if the gold converts into silver. Oh, a cliff jump. Quill jumps from a ledge and gra or a ledge grab like an athlete. Oh, cool. So I'm gonna guess there's a limited, we, like we have a limited number of slots, but I'm gonna guess there's a lot more than four possible power-ups. <laughs> so uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. I'm also, so another thing I'm probably gonna do different with this series is I'm probably gonna, oh, that wasn't what I meant to do. I'm probably gonna, no, I died. Oh no, and you lose all your coins. Oh, wait. Um. Oh, okay, so you go back. You go back to the overworld. Oh gosh, so if you die, oh, that's kind of brutal. Okay, run to it says. <laughs> okay, so Greenwood Glade, I think this is where we're supposed to be. All right, um, what was I even saying? Um, I'm probably gonna do a little bit more editing in this series than I normally do because I'm probably gonna die a lot and uh, probably have just general disasters. Oh no, okay, quickly, quickly kill that thing. <laughs> um, is it different? I almost feel like it's a little different. Oh, that didn't work too well. 
So the other thing that I have heard, and it does look like this is happening, is that, no, nope, I keep missing just barely. Okay, oh, there we go. So you don't have to be super precise, I guess. Um, oh yeah, we lost all the things we earned too. This is different, that's for sure. All right, let's go up here. But um, the thing that I've heard too is that if you miss, it takes longer for Koji to come back to you than if you successfully hit. Oh, no, 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 sir. No, sir, -y. that's not something I wanna mess around with. Uh, let's go up here. Oh, this guy is bad news. I'm trying to kind of push myself to actually learn the game and not just like cheese my way through things. So I'm taking a few risks here, but I think it is uh, randomized each time. Oh, heck yeah, so many coins. So many coins, that's always what we want. We always want uh, some, some coins here to help us out along the way. And you can also, so one thing I'm not showing here, or I haven't mentioned yet, I don't think, is that uh, I'm releasing X to uh, release Koji early. Um, I don't know if I've said that before or not, but you can actually do that. So you don't have to wait the whole time. You can, you can release it early and he'll fly away properly. Okay, so this guy is going to go get him. Okay, there we go. <laughs> uh, there's several of these guys here. All right, oh, almost, almost two birds with one stone there. Okay, go get him. And if we go, no, no, darn it. I'm glad I didn't run into him though. All right, there we are. We're good, this guy wants some monies. Oh yeah, you can convert gold into silver, I think. Oh, Quill is invulnerable for a brief period. Yeah, heck yeah, let's go ahead and insert that there. Oh, that's gonna go away though, isn't it? Oh, that's, that's gonna go away. Oh, but we were invulnerable, so that's okay. Okay, oh, is it gonna, so is it, what's gonna happen when it goes away? It's gonna break, isn't it? Or maybe it just recharges or something. Oh, why are we trapped here? Um, I don't know what's happening. I'm a little bit worried though. All right, oh, all right. Oh, I keep, so hold on. There we go, got one. We, oh, I bet we have to defeat like a certain number of enemies. Oh, and it does actually properly break too. That's kind of unfortunate. All right, so that's a limited time one, but basically you can equip different- <gasps> No! Oh no! You can equip different power-ups, uh, it seems like. Pretty much. Okay, there's lots of- lots of money down there, so we wanna just- Oh! 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 Oh no! I got damaged still! Get out of there! Get out of there! <laughs> okay, come on. We gotta take this- this stupid mushroom out. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I'll probably do more editing in the series than my normal one, just because there's going to be kind of a lot of, uh, probably a lot of disaster moments, and so I'll try to show more of the, well, well I'll, I'll show some of the disaster moments, but I kind of want to show more of the moments when, when something's actually happening versus just me dying repeatedly, <laughs> uh, and repeatedly failing. What? Oh! Hold on! Okay, so... I want... Oh, I want... I want here, what if I do this? Oh, two can trading. Okay, so you, you do have to click it. I was gonna, I thought you had to select it somehow. Welcome traveler, buy anything you like with your silver coins. Okay, oh, I want, so recover one health point, increase the maximum of health, heck yes. Please, please, I'm gonna need that. Let's recover one heart point. Um, oh, I don't have enough, no, okay, darn it. Display chests and warp points on the map. You can jump away from vertical walls. Gold chests are cheaper to open. Oh, these are all so expensive. Oh, I think the, um, I think the coins on the right are more expensive because I don't have any of these. Oh, you can get a mana rock as well. So there's nothing really I can do, but I'm going to continue on. So we got an extra health point, but we need to actually, um, okay. So how do you combo is what I'm trying to figure out. All right. Okay. And we got that. Come on. No! No! Darn it! Okay. Because I think they're saying if you get a combo of four... Oh, no, 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 no! No! No, 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 no! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Oh, I fell! I fell! I fell! Okay, let's come back up here. So I'm going to do that, and I'm gonna do that. Oh, that was not what I wanted to do. Okay, let's go at you. There we go. And took him out. I'm still gonna die. I'm gonna lose that, that extra heart point that I earned. Okay. No, no! Oh, come on! Oh my gosh, okay, game over. So, what if I hit this? What if I do that? That's gonna take me... Oh, it just restarts the run automatically. <laughs> okay, and I think it's different each time. Well, this looks similar. Alright. No, this is different still. This was not what it was before, so it changes every time. 
I might have a real hard time getting through some of these. <laughs> Again, this is very different than the usual style of game that I play, and I'm really excited to, to kind of branch out here, but it does mean that I have, like, no experience. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, and uh, I'm definitely suffering the consequences for that and paying the price for it. Okay, let's take that punk out. We've got some monies. That's always good. Let's come across here. All right. Let's... Oh, that was... That did not help us. Okay. All right. Get him. No! Oh, come on! We just missed! All right, get him. Get him. There we go. All right. Third time's the charm. Just like that. That didn't actually help us, so... I think... Nope. That didn't work. Okay, if we do this... There we go. All right, and... Throw him right down. Oh, we got him. I was a little worried we weren't because I didn't have room to jump away if we didn't. Alright, let's hop up here and just... Oh, I should have gone a little bit up. Can do that. Alright. Oh, this guy's gonna gonna kill us if we're not careful here. Alright, let's jump up and uh, we can just... Oh, almost. Alright. There we go. Got that guy. Oh, we got the other guy. Oh, so you have to like... So it's not necessarily if you're flying, you just have to have, like, really good successive throws. Like, you have to immediately recall him, pretty much. Um, there we go, perfect. So you basically have to recall him straight to you and then throw him again, pretty much. So there's two paths here. I like the looks of this one more. This one seems more interesting, so I'm gonna go across here. And, oh, no, that's not what I wanted. Oh, it worked, though. It did work. All right, so let's go up here. Oh gosh, okay. So I'm going to get this guy. I'm going to get this. No, I missed him, darn it. All right, let's go over here. I'm gonna open this chest first since he was in here. It's a lot of money. So I'm guessing these chests that all kind of look the same here are gonna be, like they're gonna be similar things in each one probably. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, all right, hold on. So I've got to... Oh, come on! I thought I could get him. Why is it that these are... Oh, I, I aimed the wrong way. Of course I did. Why is it that these guys are so difficult to hit for some reason? I'm having such a hard time with them. Really? Okay, come here. No! Okay. There we go. We got one. And we got two. Finally! So you had to be kind of like right underneath them, I guess. So let's come up here. I love that. I do love the ambience of this game. It's definitely pretty, pretty amazing. I, I love the way it looks. I love the way it feels. I love the pixel style. I'm, I'm a real sucker for pixel games. I don't know if I've ever said that before, but I, I love the pixel, the pixel style. There's just something about the simplicity of it that's so amazing, and uh, I truly do really enjoy it. There we go. Got that guy. Um, but yeah, I love the way the game looks and feels. Oh, there's like bunnies down there too. Okay, let's let's open this up, and we can oh cast them off at a, a faster speed. Oh, okay. So if we, so it doesn't necessarily mean that he has to be faster, but he can be. All right, we got that guy, and we can do that. That wasn't a combo though. So basically, you have to like in one consecutive. So like like nope, I didn't do it there. <laughs> um. So let's do that again. Oh, so yeah, basically like in one consecutive thing kind of like that, where it's all very much at once. Oh, you have to like earn a certain amount, I think, sometimes. So let's go ahead here, and then you can go ahead and go there. No, nope, that didn't work. I was gonna say, I, I thought I maybe could do that, but I didn't, I didn't actually get it quite right. Okay, come on, get him, get him. No, <laughs> that didn't work so well. And get this guy. I'm getting better at the aiming slowly. There we go. A little bit better. I'm, I'm getting... Oh, wait. Oh, two can see her. Two can see her. Two can see her. Okay, let's go ahead. We will purchase from this. Oh, there's a fast travel point, too. So, I want to increase his maximum. And we don't need to do that just yet. Compass. Combo timer. Oh, I want that. Okay. So, we can come back to this guy, though. So... There's an entrance waypoint, there's waypoint one, so we finally found that. Um, I think, can I save here is my question. <laughs> um, nope. <laughs> it's not, not quite that, uh, not quite that nice. Oh, there's Koji's feather, so I think the, um... I think the, the, um, well, let's just go back. I think the, the feathers, I think, are something you eventually can swap out. And different ones have different effects, I believe, if I'm remembering this right. There we go, got that guy. 
The aiming is getting easier. I'm, I'm learning to do the aiming, that's for sure. All right, what's down here? I'm learning to do the aiming, I say, and then I'm gonna just miss stupidly. So, oh, we're trapped in here until we defeat a bunch of guys, aren't we? So let's, oh, that was not good, okay. Let's, let's jump up here. Nope, that didn't work, all right. So, oh, I keep missing him, darn it. All right, um, if I can get this guy. Oh, I got that guy. I want the combo timer, because it's within a certain amount of time, I guess. All right, oh, I keep, I threw him the wrong way. I say I'm getting better at aiming, and then I just prove that I'm not getting better at aiming. Okay, let's check it out this guy, check it out this guy. Oh no, I got damage though. Okay, oops, nope. Okay, let's throw it at this guy. All right, th these ones I have a hard time hitting because they're moving targets. All right, um, got him. Got, nope, didn't get that guy. Right down. The diagonal ones are the ones that I have a harder time with because I think I have, I tend to push, no, I tend to push, oh, I forgot that was how they damaged you. I tend to push the tie, or I tend to push the controller key in the wrong direction. Okay, forged in times gone by, now worthless to all but one. Oh. Okay. So that's like our inventory, so we can carry stuff around there. We need some health, though. We definitely need some health, so I'm gonna go back to- No, Mr. Toucan is gone! Oh, I'm gonna be real sad. So wait, maybe, you know what, I think I'm gonna actually go ahead, we'll go to the entrance waypoint. I'm gonna leave because I don't want to lose all the things that I have, and I don't think I'll do that if I exit. So if I go out- Oh, I did! Are you kidding me? Oh, okay, so I bet everything is per dungeon, so that was kind of a painful run. Okay, wait, so... So yeah, okay, I want to try this one more time. Um... Oh no! Oh no! Okay, necessity is the mother of invention! Go! 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 Okay, oh no, I missed it wrong. So you can see the little, the little combo thing flashes. Alright, if I go like this, and then if I go down here, yeah, you can see, so it's, you don't necessarily have to have it be, um, all at once, you just have to, you just have to kind of, um, you have to be real fast about it, like, you don't have a lot of margin for error. Oh no. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, I'm gonna die again, probably. But yeah, so I'm gonna guess you either lose your stuff anytime you leave a stage. Oh, yep, I died again. <laughs> I'm gonna guess you lose your stuff either every time you um, leave a stage or every time you uh, end a stage is when it's gonna save your stuff. So this might take a little bit. We're gonna come back to this in a, a later episode, I think. So this has been a really fun introduction to the game. Uh, I'm having fun even though I keep dying a lot. Uh, I think I am getting the hang of it. I can feel myself getting better. I just really need to get used to the controller more, I think, because most of the games I play it with a keyboard. And so the controller is kind of like, what the heck is this? <laughs> so we're, we're getting there, but uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Uh, hopefully you're not too frustrated with my newbiness at this game. And uh, I hope you're looking forward to coming back to this as much as I am, because I know I'm definitely looking forward to seeing the rest of what this game has to offer. But we're going to go ahead and wrap up this episode here for today, because it is about that time again. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. But until then, this is Jay, over and out.